Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a weekend vlog. I thought I would pick up the camera and vlog my weekend. I didn't do like a weekly vlog this week. I kind of took took the week, the actual weekdays off and I thought I would vlog the weekend. And then I thought I would bring you along my Sunday morning tomorrow because I don't normally share my Sundays on social media. So you're in for a little, a little sneak peek of what my Sundays look like. Across the room When our eyes met I never knew That I could feel this way And it's kinda strange Don't even know your name a cup of tea I'm just gonna take a little 15 minute tea break before I need to go pick the girls up they go to so I say every time I do a weekend vlog they go to my mother-in-law's on a Saturday morning for a couple of hours to play with their cousins and it just means me and Joe can get jobs done normally or sometimes we'll go for breakfast or like have some time together sometimes we'll go for a walk we usually do the food shop in that time but today Joe has actually been well Joe's working today he's a teacher so he obviously doesn't normally work on a Saturday but they've got some kind of revision thing I don't know so he's working a couple of hours he'll be back at 12 so I was like well it's a good chance for me to get things done in the house that I can't normally do when the, or not that I can't do but that it's easier to do without the kids there so that is what I've done I did manage to do I did the bathroom fully the main bathroom which I was pleased about because that takes a while and we're actually getting that done this year it's getting completely ripped out so I'm just kind of it's just maintenance work like it's really old I can't wait to get it ripped out so we're just like I'm just maintaining the cleanliness, cleanliness of it and then I put some clothes away for both girls actually and sorted out Sophia's clothes I didn't really plan on doing that but it, it needed doing just I've been putting her three to four clothes away she's only just turned three but she's very tall so she's going into four to five age four to five clothes so I sorted those out I dusted everywhere so I dusted Sophia and Amelia's bedroom and then the office room I don't think I filmed that bit and I've just got my bedroom to dust I hoovered both the girls bedrooms so all I've got left to do upstairs now is the ensuite my bedroom and the landing and then hoover the office room and I've put the clothes that I've kept aside for centre parks in the office room that's why I just gave it dust I put them on the desk in there so I'm feeling good the downstairs I dusted that the other day and I've done the downstairs toilet so all I've got to do is just hoover everywhere and give the kitchen floors a mop so 
that may end up getting done tomorrow because we'll probably cook tomorrow and Joe is quite a messy cook. Joe does the Sunday cooking. So I'll probably just wait until he's finished cooking and then we can get that done tomorrow. Struggled, and that's because I am. We just got caught in a big rain shower. It's still raining. It's been raining pretty much all day, but we thought, oh, I need to hang on. Oh, I just remembered I need to stop my outdoor hours tracker. I'm doing the thousand hours outside. Um, yeah. Oh. Um, yeah, so we uh, got caught in a, thank you, darling, in a rain shower. I think it's more than a shower. It's pretty heavy. You can probably hear it. Um, but we thought there was a slight break, so we thought we'll just take the opportunity to get outside and go for a little walk as a family. Um, and then it, it poured again, so we're a bit wet. Joe's just taken Sophia to the shops. Just you and me. Yeah. I yeah. didn't do a lot this afternoon while they were napping. Joe went to the food shop with Sophia. Mimi napped. I chilled for a bit and then finished off the upstairs, so yeah. That's all. Oh, actually, I've just got to do the hoovering. Oh, Mimi, should we go do the hoovering upstairs now? Oh, she wants to put that the lid back on. So we're going to go do the hoovering and we'll catch up later. This is the face of a very tired, touched out mum. <laughs> I probably look as overwhelmed as I feel. Not Maybe not overwhelmed. That's not the word. But it's just I'm just tired, like physically tired. I just seem to be carrying one or two toddlers on me. At all times at the moment. I think Amelia is going through a separation anxiety phase. She's always been so clingy to me. She's extra, extra clingy at the moment. Like it's like she needs to be on me at all times. Joey's just putting her to bed. I did manage. Well, I had to go up because she was wouldn't leave me. Um, and then they were happy brushing their teeth, and I just snuck down and I'm done. Everything's tidy, I'm done for the day, and I'm ready just to sit and chill. We are thinking of cutting out screen time completely for the girls. We have had a lot of big emotions from Sophia. And I think a lot of it, well, I know a lot of it stems to the telly. She just wants it all the time. And she always she wants the iPad, like everything she just wants the telly. And she's finishing meals early because she thinks she'll go get the telly. She is like expecting it as soon as we get in the house. It's just, and we don't we've not, we don't give her it all the time. That's the thing. So because of that, because she gets it part of the time in like controlled, like certain times of the day, like in the morning when they're having their milk. And then when Mimi naps, she gets a bit. And then usually later on, just before tea. Because she's getting some of it, she's expecting it all the time and so when we're saying no it's not telly time or it's not ipad time she's just getting very distressed about it so i think well i think we've both been feeling it for a while that we need to try and cut screen time out altogether for her and see how that goes it, it was going to be so hard but my hope is that it will eliminate that sort of massive meltdown basically so we'll see how it goes. Tomorrow is Sunday. I will update you on how that goes. And ugh, I am so tired. <laughs> Sunday and we are about to head to church. I am on the kids team today so I do the youngest group two to four. This is, I only do it like once or twice a month, it's like a rotor. So that is what I'm doing today. So I obviously can't film that bit but I'll try and get a few clips of what we're like in church but we've had a nice chilled morning so far. No telly has been absolutely fine. She hasn't even asked for it. She asked for it once this morning and we just said no. And it's just okay let's get some games out then. I was gobsmacked. So anyway, let's go to church. church and 
and it ended up just me and me and Sophia and the other helper for a while in my group and then someone came in a bit late today so that was quite nice just to spend some time with Sophia just playing so I did actually manage to film a couple of clips of just her and we have had a delicious delicious lunch Joe cooked us an amazing meal he actually did a curry which is not a typical Sunday dinner it's rainy again but I've just found out that my nephew is going to be playing at the fields in our village so that's at two in about an hour. I've just popped Mimi down for her nap. Potentially, if it's not too rainy, I'm gonna walk Sophia around so we can go watch him play in this little park there as well. But I do need to tidy up the mess that is our kitchen. Because it's messy. So I don't even know what to do with that. Um, we seem to have lost all our Tupperware. So I think we're gonna, I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do with that, to be honest. I'll let Joe figure that one out. But right now I actually have to edit a video because I'm just really behind on my editing. So I'm gonna sit and edit and then we'll see if we wanna go to this football match. Else, then do that one. That one, what? No, are you helping mummy? Yeah. You're very good at helping me, aren't you? Both nap times are finished now, so no, no, no. Mimi, no pushing. No. She's just started pushing like that. No, so we're gonna put some laundry away now, and you two are gonna do some playing. <laughs> Yeah? No, maybe I'll fighting yeah. apparently. Right, I am back on my laptop. I've got it just here. Because one thing I started doing for March is to track our finances better. So, oh, I'm just gonna, right, just clear all of that. So I've been like doing our finances. I put them all into a spreadsheet and categorized them. I went through like our bank statement and did every single payment. Um, and then, so I did that for February. I From that I made a budget of each of those categories and this week I'm tracking it this month I'm tracking it to see if we're going to stay in budget so um I'm just doing that I feel like I try and do it every week so like every weekend I sort of do that week's put that week's in um and then at some point in the next few days because we are near the end of March by the time you watch this it will be the end of March I will use this month's budget to see where we need to trim the fats where we spent too much and also do next month's budget do april's budget so yeah let's do that it's time consuming but it's worth it go, go, go. Is so happy. This is what I look like now at the end of a day. We were like rolling on the floor, playing. Mimi loves like if I lay down and climbing on me. Um, and also, look at this. This has been growing for the past few days. And then I picked it. I tried to pick it. And now I've just made it worse. Anyway, so we'll just, we'll just ignore that. But it is seven o'clock now. The girls, well, just gone seven. They've just gone down to bed. I've done a quick tidy up. Oh, there's Rosie. Rosie, do you mind? Excuse me. Right, okay. 
there we go. Uh, I've just done a quick tidy up of the house. It's all nice and fresh. It does make such a difference when I keep on top of it. I just never have to do like a massive thing. It's just so much better. I have got the girls things just look out the window. I've got the girls bags ready. I like to get them ready, put them at the bottom of the stairs and just get all that ready. And I've got my bag ready. Um yeah, we're doing well. <laughs> Look at this over fluffy babe, she needs a groom. Can't even see you, can you? We need to cut this bit and then we'll book you in for a groom. Anyway, she's taken my camera spot. Um, it's probably really, well, it's like weird lighting. I, what am I gonna say? I've lost my train of thought. I don't know, but it's been a really, really lovely weekend. We just did like a big, massive family worship session. Pretty much all afternoon, like since Amelia's been awake, all we've done is play music. I played my piano, Joe played his guitar, and then we listened to some worship. We did actually technically have the telly on, but it was just to play the music, so I feel like it doesn't count as screen time. And we were all there together, and it was worship, so it's not like... Anyway, I am going to go upstairs now and do my little evening routine my sunday evening routine where i like to just have a little pamper do a face mask i need something to help with this do a face mask i just i actually been doing my feet recently as well like a foot scrub and a foot mask just have a little chill get my pajamas and then i watch tv i did film this um a month or so ago so i will leave that linked somewhere I'll leave it on the end screen. I'll leave it linked for you so that you can see what I'm about to do now. But basically, if you end this video here and then pick up that video, that's what's going to continue. So thank you so much for watching. I have no idea what this vlog has turned out to be, really. It's just a mishmash of our weekend. But we are loving these slow weekends, this slow living. Love it. Highly recommend it. I am going to do a video on it probably the end of April, beginning of May all about slow living, kind of everything I've learned so far since I've been doing it at the beginning of this year. If you did like this video, then please hit the subscribe button. And if you like the sound of any of the future videos I've talked about, then turn on that bell notification so you don't miss them. And yeah, go and check out this video to see what I'm about to do now. Bye guys.